Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and start because yeah, we're here, everyone's here. So hi everyone, how are we all doing? I hope you're having a good weekend. Hello Bella, hello Bente, hi Totoro, how are you? Hi Blair, hi Mia, hi Jasmine, hi Alex, welcome to your first stream, I hope you enjoy it. Welcome Daisy, hi Q, yes it's an early stream, let's do it. I've been up since half five EST because it's been snowing where I live, oh my gosh. I'm, yeah, it's been, oh Stonks, hey, how are you? I hope you're doing well. How's everyone's weekends been? Let me know. Hi Dale, welcome in. Hi Jim, Jamea, Jamaya, Jabina. Sorry, I hope I got there in the end. I'm good, I'm all right. It's my first day off of work, so that's good. That's a bonus. Looking forward to spending some time playing Animal Crossing and relaxing, making some videos. I've got some exciting ones planned for the week, so that's cool. Hi, Christina, how are you? And I'm super excited to finish this island. I'm so close. Oh no, Stronks. I hope you're okay, and I hope you feel better soon. And I hope all of your family are okay. I'm really sorry. Looks outside to see if it snowed. Has it snowed, Tessa? Hi, Anxuna. The barrel advert left a mark on my brain. More barrels. It's not a barrel advert, but it will be an advert. Um, it's one that I haven't done before. You can guess which advert do you think the new advert is. So we'll do our usual. When we get to like 50 likes, I'll play it for you guys. But yeah, if you want to guess which one it is and then it'll be like a surprise I won't tell you what it's about but yeah <laughs> oh no Danny that's not a good way to start the morning I just pulled my first oh that's just reminded me I need to do something stand by talk amongst yourselves for a while I sound like a teacher <laughs> I sound like a teacher okay two sex I totally forgot to do this Furs, I waited two hours for this stream. Oh, I'm, I, that's pretty, that's pretty impressive. I don't think anyone's waited that long for one of my streams ever before. So I think you've won an award there for sure. Okay, here we go. Uh, there we go. Right. Right, Danny, you should all be set up as a mod now. I'm sorry I forgot to do it. Anxuna, thank you so much for becoming a Daisy member. Don't forget to check out your emotes. And if you're in the Discord, you can link your YouTube channel to get the role on there. If not, just remember to drop me a message and I'll set it up for you for sure. I'm about to switch to a snowy day on my island to match the weather. <laughs> nice. We don't have snow here in the UK. It's just a bit cloudy. It was super foggy last night. Um, but it's all okay now, so fingers crossed. Right, first things first, we are going to finish off this island. Kind of, maybe. I might decide on doing some other stuff. I have thought about adding a little bit of items to the beach area. Just to kind of finish them off a bit and make them look a bit better. Um, but we'll see how that goes. I do need to just... This is kind of the only bit of open area that I've got, so yeah. Of course you can, Bella. I would love to see it. Hi, Lena. How are you? Nice to see you here. Oh, we have a wood partition shortage by the sounds of it. Oh, no, that's not good. Um, I was thinking about doing like a little gazebo -y type area here. Because I haven't... I've used one. But nothing more. So maybe just a little cute area would be nice. Hi, Angel. Welcome in. As I said at the beginning of the stream, don't forget to like because there is a new advert that I'm super excited to show you all. Um, and yeah, uh, guess in the chat if you haven't already what you think the advert might be about. Oh, Lena, thank you. I'm, I won't lie, I'm having a bit of turmoil about this island. I'll put it this way, it's probably not one of my favourite islands and I don't know why that is. It's definitely not one of my favourite islands that I've done. But it, it, yeah. How so many areas left to do? No, just this one, this little tiny bit, and then I'm done, I promise. Um, yeah. 
And then it is just a matter of going around the island, making sure I've not got duplicate flowers and things. Thank you, Alex. And morning, April. How are you? Hope you had a good sleep. I feel like it's super early for people in America. And I do apologize for that, but hopefully you're having a good start to the day. Grab your morning coffee, grab yourself some breakfast and get cozy. I know it's snowing on my Switch, so I don't know if that's the coziest vibes to be giving out, but <laughs> there you go. Lol, it's 8.33 a.m. for me, but wide awake. Well, 7.30, 7.30 ES. Oh, uh, is it central time that's 8, that's 7.30? I get really confused. The time zones hurt my brain. Oh, nice, Dale. Though the partitions are great and the giant vine is lovely as well. Oh yeah, shout out to all the Europeans. I hope you had a nice lunch and your morning was off to a good start as well. CST, yeah, that makes sense. I thought you were. Oh, let's try and make this central. There we go. Eight thirty is EST. Ah, okay. I will get the hang of it one day. I need to eat breakfast. I have never worked on a build like I have with my gyroid forest. Five days on your gyroid forest? Wow. Forever. That must be beautiful. Right. I need to stop trying to do that. I'm not trying to uh, cancel my construction. I definitely need that. Nope. Nope. Eastern in 8 a.m. three hours behind. So, okay, so like California. So if you're talking time difference from New York to California, you're talking like three hours, is that right? So it's 5.30 for California. Yes, okay, I get it, I get it. That makes sense. Hi, Alicia, happy Sunday to you as well. I hope you're having a good weekend. Oh. Alex, I just realized I could have told you when there's a snowy day. It's the 20th of January is a snowy day. Sorry, I didn't think about that, but that does work. Right, let's try and make this look kind of pretty. Why have I got so much money in my inventory? Let's put that away. Hi, Amanda, welcome in. Good morning, Pam. What a lovely way to start the day. Oh, thank you. It is going to be a super chill Sunday, definitely. Hi, Minicule. How are you? I hope you're having a wonderful Sunday as well. I grew my first two dry roads yesterday. Oh, well done. Which ones did you get? Good morning, Catty. Oh, I only had to time travel. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's all right then. Sorry. That was really dozy. Okay. Do I want to push this back a bit so that I can actually... I was thinking about putting like a seating area here, but I don't think I'll be able to do that if it's like... Hmm. No, I have an idea. Do I have enough toperies? I've ne I've not joined any Facebook groups for um, Animal Crossing. I didn't... Honestly, it wasn't one of the places where I thought to go to. Not that I can add any more social media for Animal Crossing to my repertoire. It would be too overwhelming. Oh, we have a few. Oh, Bella. That's nice. Um, Chloe, hi. Welcome in. Oh my god, I have so many gyro gyros on my beach. I love them and don't want to move them yet. Oh, they are really cute. I, d I haven't done a gyroid farm, but I do want to do more for... Um, for my next island because some of them are super cute and I think that they'll fit in with like a spring theme. Ooh. Move that down a bit. I finally found a vi my vibe for New Island and it's the last day of vacation day. Oh no! The Crumploid and Flutteroid. I think I know which one the Flutteroid is. That's cute. Oh. 
I'm sure April won't mind if you call her by her name. If she does, I'm sorry, April, for calling you by your name. Yes, it's gonna, next island is gonna be a spring vibe, for sure. I only have Instagram and I can't keep on top of that. I know, I struggle with Instagram. I do prefer Twitter, I won't lie. I don't know why. I just feel it's easier to kind of interact with it. I don't know. I love gyros. There's one that blows bubbles, it's so cute. Oh. I have to find, I think I've seen that one as well. Um, I can't remember the name of it though. I like the gyroid that does those bubbles. They seem drunk. <laughs> That's one word for it, isn't it? Uh, Recently, I've also found out how you can find out the weather forecast. Oh yes. Um, I can't remember the name of the website, but I did do that on one of my um, previous item, my previous islands. Is it called Meteo Nook or something like that? And if you're wanting to know for when you get, um, like, what's they called? What are they called when the stars fall down? Yeah. Yeah, it is Meteo Nook. Um, it takes a while to get there because you have to input all of the data like you have to put in what the weather is like on your days but when it works it, it works really nicely so you know which days you're gonna have the i don't want that so you know what days you're gonna have the um what are they called shooting star showers that seems like that seems a bit excessive like i don't feel like that's the name they have a shorter name i'm sure Hi Ellie, how are you? I hope you're doing well. I'm really, I need to get some more shout outs set up because Ellie has a little YouTube channel as well. So if you want to check her out, definitely do. Um, and Stonks, I, I think the next theme is definitely going to be very string, string, very spring-like um, and with a lot of green. Um, green spring, I think. If you watch my mood board video for spring, I think it's going to be like one of them. Just because I really like green. <laughs> That's pretty much it. Um, I really like green. I want to do something natural and something... Meteor showers. That's it. That's it. My brain fog is so bad some days. How did you push that thing? Oh, okay. So when you want to push things, all you do is you walk up to it, hold down A, and then you can push and pull. Just move your Joy-Con on the left the to watch it, whichever way you want it to go. Strinkle. Oh, that sounds funny. I can't imagine what strinkle would look like. Um, yeah, so I need some green in my life. The The white and stuff has just put me off. No, time traveling doesn't affect it, Tessa, because it will be a particular um, seed that everyone's island has, um, and so it can read it. You don't have to worry about time traveling. Um, you can time travel forward to the particular days. You just have to make sure that you found your particular weather seed and it's the correct one, which is the time consuming part to it. By the way, I love all the mood board. It makes me want to do the Easter one. I think the Easter one would be cute, really cute. And you definitely got time to do it. There's definitely time. Oh, wow, Bella. That was so quick. That was super quick. Where's my Emma's new theme, green strinkle? <laughs> I'm gonna have to buy myself one of those like string shopping bags now, aren't I? <laughs> I obviously haven't had enough caffeine this morning. That's my problem. Where can I? Where can we see the mood board? Um, Tessa, it's a whole video where I did like um, themes for spring to give you some inspiration. Um, it should be on my channel somewhere. I wish we could type a word in. Me too. Me too. Where's? And I also wish I could remember which way the alphabet goes. There we go. And some custom designs because I always forget. Hi, MGS. I'm good. How are you? 
Okay guys, there's 74 of you watching. If you want to see the new advert and figure out who or what the new advert is about, then we need 50 likes. So we're super close already. If you want to get there and you haven't already liked it, then please remember to do so. Hi Martina, welcome in. I don't actually know where I'm gonna put this, but I'm gonna get it out anyway. There's a lot of street lamps over here. Hmm. Maybe not. Whoa, that shot up quickly. <laughs> um, thank you. Uh... Oh, thank you, April. Thank you for finding that. I normally go live for about two hours, um, but it will just depend. If I'm super close to getting where I want to be, then I might just keep going for a bit longer. Like, 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 I cannot get a snack until it's been shown. <laughs> Hi, Fiona, how are you? You've probably joined at the right time. So I've not seen any guesses as to what people think this video is about. So maybe it'll be a bit of a surprise. I might have hinted about it before, so we shall see. Um, right, so who's ready? Are we ready? Are you all watching? Are you prepared for this? That's okay, Lisa, that's okay. Okay, I hope you enjoy this one. Um, it took a little while this morning, so fingers crossed you enjoy it. Here goes. Hello, totally awesome people. You can call me Hav if you want. Today I'm coming at you with an offer that will blow your mind. Are you wanting to escape the razzle dazzle of the city? Then come and join us at my totally chill community co-op. The vibe is so mellow you'll spend your time horizontal. There are some super groovy residents to welcome you. If you have any questions bouncing around in your noggin, then get in touch. Peace out, man. Okay, so there you go. <laughs> that was Har's little advert to join his co-op. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, it's not Happy Home Paradise Bella, it's just my normal island. Um, bless my husband for trying to do a bit more of like a relaxed hippie voice. Um, he was trying, I think he did pretty well, if I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed that. Um, oh, let me have a look at this dress one sec. Hi Justine, welcome in. Oh, thank you Naya, hi. <laughs> that might be my favorite, oh nice. Hi Justine as well. Let's have a look at this dress. I'm gonna have to definitely do some more. We keep forgetting and putting them off, but yeah, they're on my list of things to do. Cause they're just fun. They're fun. I'm gonna check it out now, Bella. Hi, Lolly, welcome in. I think I know who you are. I think I know who you are. Because you change your name to villagers a lot. Um, right, let's have a look at this. I love the advert. I love how he does the adverts. Well, I wrote the advert and then I make him say it and then he changed it up a little bit. Oh, thank you, Justine. Oh, that's so cute. Bella, that's really good. For how you did that so quickly. For such a quick dress, that was amazing. I'm going to save it just so I've got it there so we don't forget about it. There you go. So it's saved in my dresses now. Will you do an island tour for this when it's complete? I love the ones you did for Laurel and Maplewood. Um, I will, um, unless anyone else wants to do it. Um, normally I do do my own. I don't know why I do my own. Um, some people don't, but I do enjoy touring my islands because then I get, can give you guys the full perspective as to what I was thinking behind the builds and stuff. So I think I do prefer doing my own. Um, but yeah, we'll see. We'll see. It should be 
soon. It has to be my third favourite, Barrel and the Roost ones are still better. I did say to JG this morning, should we just do an updated Barrel one? Like, with actual video in it, but I still... He was like, no, I don't think we can. Like, the Barrel one is so iconic, it just needs to stay... It needs to stay like that, I think. Maybe one day I'll redo it, but there's so many different ads we can do. So yeah, we'll see. I love Harv's Island just to get the hairdos. <laughs> the hairdos are so fun. I haven't, I think I've got them all now though because um, Harriet just sits outside of Harv's hat. A uh, Harv's hat, Harv's house. <laughs> oh dear. Right, what was I doing? Flowers. Love the barrel court aesthetic, great item. 100% Amanda. If you love the barrel, you're in the right place. I love your tours. I don't tour mine because by the time I'm done, I don't remember what I was thinking. Oh. I really have no idea what to do with this now. Um. Hmm. Oh, I know what I could put behind it. Some party lights, maybe? Um, that could work. I'm all for making snowballs, snowboys. The dialogue is hilarious when you make a bad one. That's so true. Um, I'm terrible as well. Probably in my time, I may have made maybe like three or four in total. Um, so you're not alone, Alex, if that makes you feel any better. Where are the party lights gone? Do I have any? Oh yeah, you have one, good. Did I say hi to you, Mabe? If I didn't say hi to you, I'm sorry, hello. The one thing better than the barrel, in my opinion, is a pirate barrel combined with the sideways barrel. I, I am kind of, I do kind of agree with you, Anxuna. The one thing that disappoints me so much about the, um, Pirate Barrels is the fact that they have the skull and crossbones on them. I know you can hide them. Um, yeah, but no, yeah. I, I, yeah, they're nice. Bella, why didn't you put your MA code in? And then we can see, um, we can see all your designs. That would be nice to see all of your, your designs that you've done. Or post it and then I'll save it and have a look at it later. I love the pirate barrel with the sideways barrel with the pale green wheat field. Oh yes, I do like the wheat fields. They're so cute. And I'm definitely going to use them in my spring island a lot more. Like dotted around more as opposed to using weeds. I think that will look nice. Um, my local time is is 10 to 1 in the afternoon. No, 10 to 2. 10 to 2 in the afternoon. So 1.50. Okay, thank you for posting it, Bella. I'll save it and I'll check it out later once we've done a bit of decorating. Am I really out of triangular toperies? Um. Oh, I know where I have some. Oh. There's Bo. I wonder what he's up to. Oh no. There were some here. Where did I put them? Or is it the next one? Yeah, I don't think these need to go here. Oh, that's fine. Yeah, we'll check it out later. Oh, DIY bottle. Oh, I definitely have that recipe. Too much green, maybe. Maybe a barrel needs to go here, actually. To cap off the corner. Oh, oh no, Danny, you missed it. Oh, 
Do you want me to play it again for you? Shall I play it again? Just a special little viewing for you and the other 80 people. Um, well, I'll tell you what. When we get a few more... I'll give it a little while because we don't want to overplay it. But I will play it again for you. Don't worry. I'll play it again. I can't have you missing out. Afternoon, Nick. How are you? Hi, Vicky. Welcome to your first live. I hope you enjoy it. I had this weird dream that I still had Renee on my island, but I thought I had already kicked it out. Oh, no. <laughs> um, sometimes they say I put them in my inventory. Sometimes I put them to trash. Sometimes I keep them in case anyone else wants them. Um, yeah, I just do a whole bunch of things. Um, being able to put them in your storage is so good. So handy. Um, I really do appreciate that ability. Um... Uh, oh, okay, I can wait. We can get to 100 likes. <laughs> That's setting the bar high. If we get there. <laughs> right. Um, Mum cushion. Triangular topiary. Wooden boxes. Where's my... Oh. I'm sure I got my mini... Yeah, there we go. I love the plain arch lights. I do as well. I think the brown is probably my favourite. Oh, hi, Chris. Following in the mantra, when in doubt, put a barrel there. I had to open area on my island and build a barrel storage. Do you know what? I feel like a few people have um, gone about with um, a barrel storages now. I need to see them all. If you have a barrel storage and you're in the Discord, please post it. I want to see them all. I know April did one on her island. Um, I did one on Maplewood as well, so <laughs> they're becoming a thing. Oh, Ellie, do you think so? I feel like, I don't know. I guess sometimes I do. Now I'm just like procrastinating because I'm not sure what to do. Every time you laugh, my puppy is alert and tries to find you from the house. Is he in love or is he broken? I hope I haven't broken your puppy. I am determined. I am very determined. I want to see some green. I sound like a small child having a tantrum because I'm fed up of the snow. <laughs> and hi, Andrea. Welcome in. Brow farms are amazing. Stick gyroids on them. Oh, that's a cute idea. I really, that's a really cute idea. Oh, do I not have any lilies? Oh, dang it. How do I mail stuff to you? Um, do you mean in the game? Your spring island is going to be both chic and fabulous. I hope I said that right. I hope so. Um, I just can't wait to, yeah, honestly. I'm not talking trash about this island. I'm sorry, island. I still hate, I still love you. Oh my gosh, I nearly just said I still hate you. I feel that I miss spring and the lovely green. It is, yeah. I don't have a thingy on me. Do you think I can get it in time before it disappears off my island? I skipped time to October? Oh. October is a nice time of year as well, definitely. Is everyone, I'm guessing because of the current time, the majority of us are Northern Hemisphere players, but has any kind of, any Northern Hemisphere players ever gone to the Southern Hemisphere just for one of their islands? Because I'm curious how that would work. I mean, I was tempted to once. <laughs> I'm sorry, I still hate you. I think we all think, feel that way sometimes. Yeah, you're not wrong. Oh, a DIY I don't have. Cherry blossom season is nice for spring. You're so right. Cherry blossom is great. All I seem to have... Oh, no, we have hyacinths as well. Definitely northern here where I love... And my island, nice. I have an island set for Australian time. See, that's what I mean, that's cool. 
Oh, where I live. <laughs> no. Sorry, Dale. I should have guessed that's what you were going to say. No, me too. I will turn it to a kangaroo, maybe. I am in the southern hemisphere, my enchanted forest, so I can have the fairy lights on summer trees for the DA. <gasps> I didn't think of that. That's such a nice idea. Hi, I'm Avatar Cody, and I'm not alone. I bought you my girlfriend, Avatar Sky. Hi, Cody. Hi, Sky. Welcome in. Hi, Crossing with Heather. And, um, Anxuna, I've done both. I've restarted and I've um, flattened. I think for this island, I'm going to restart because I want to keep the dream address. Um, I do slightly regret in the past where I've flattened because now I can't go back and visit those islands. I would. I like the idea of being able to go back and look at things um just for like maybe like more video purposes and obviously it allows people to visit the islands as well if they want to um so yeah i think i'm gonna restart this one it is a lot i don't know i don't know if it is more work feels more work sometimes um but yeah definitely gonna restart this one um hi leslie how are you I'm trying to do my Toyland entrance with spring colours for when it arrives. It's kind of ready for it. Nice. <laughs> Hello, Grumpy Monk. I hope you're having a good Sunday and a great weekend. He'll be streaming with me as my voice isn't great. Oh, that's exciting. Um, I might not be able to stay for all of your stream, April, but I'll try and get there for the majority of it. Um, I think we're going out for dinner tonight, so um, yeah, I'll try and get there for most of it. When do you expect to post your dream address? Well, I said it in a video um, that I was hoping to get it done by the end of February, but it actually meant the end of January. Um, but it might be sooner than that. Um, that was kind of like my deadline where I was being unambitious and just trying to push it out there but maybe a week or so um oh chris yeah the hunting for the diys is the worst part um there is some treasure islands which just allow you to go and learn all of the diys but it takes hours i would say it probably takes you about three four hours to learn all of the diys if you wanted to learn all of them but I just kind of pick and choose which ones I think are going to be most needed by me. And then if I pick any up along the way, then that's a bonus. Hi, Kawaii Cake. Don't apologise for being late, but thank you for saying hello. Who are your villagers on this island? Let me have a look for you. I did want to get rid of Octavian, but I might just leave him. So I've got Flo, Cleo, Cole, Felicity, Octavian... Olivia, Ellie, Bo, Eric, and Eugene. Oh, and there's the map as well if you wanted a bit longer to look at it. Me and Sky play Animal Crossing as cute couples and also Sky getting married in real life. Animal Crossing Island off my beach at the same time. Oh, that's so sweet. Hi, Tiffy. How are you? Yeah, April. It's so long. Um... Yeah, and it's, it just takes a long time to go through the process of actually learning the um, the DIY recipe, especially if you're doing it like lots of them. I'm in dire need of Nook Miles so I can buy more. Oh, the balloons are out in full force today. You want to get grinding them, Dale. They do take a while. My nook miles have definitely gone down. Previous islands, I've just kind of hoarded them. But now since the update, I think I have about 30,000. So it's not that many. Ooh, a high-end stereo. Sounds posh. Oh, it's that. <laughs> that is, I was hoping it might be a new item. Nope. Okay. Find something to go on top of this barrel. Oh, thank you. Well, thank you for being here. How was your day yesterday at um, Harry Potter Studios? I saw um, the photos. It looked amazing. I'm very jealous. It might have inspired me to look and check for tickets, but they, they seem to be sold out for quite a while, which is disappointing. Oh, hi, Oriel as well. Welcome in. If you're just joining us now, 
um, you have missed the new advert. Um, but I will play it again when we get to like 100 likes because Canada Crossing went to get coffee and missed it as well. <laughs> so there are there are people that um, that need to watch it again. So um, yeah, remember to like the stream if you're just coming in. And hopefully we'll be able to play it again soon. Um, hi Emily, hello. How is everyone? Good morning Beth as well. Good morning from Mississippi. Oh Shane. Thank you so much for the super chat. Oh my god, yes, new ad. Yes. I worked on it this morning. Well, we both worked on it. I say me, it's definitely not my voice in this video. Good morning, Awful Gaming. Welcome in. Um, I feel like... Anyone else find it hard to know what things will look like without the flowers? Um, fully grown in. Like, I feel like I need more things in here. You did, Emily, but don't worry, so did a few others, so um, we will play it again. We will play it again. Uh, let me find... It was amazing. We booked our tickets quite a few months in advance. I went into town to buy the Harry Potter books just now because my copies are buried in storage. <laughs> Oh, do you know what though? Nothing beats the old school Harry Potter covers. I don't know if, I don't know what they're like now, but I feel like some of them have changed. But when they were first released, those were OG. And I wish so much I had taken better co better care of my original copies of the Harry Potter books. Oh, damn it. Oh. Oh, Amanda, that's really cute. Well, thank you both. Thank you both. Can you give my beautiful fiance, Amanda, a massive shout out? She is honestly my rock. Guys, you are so sweet. I love that you do that together. Adorable. And congratulations if you're newly engaged or if you're upcoming wedding. Either way, congratulations. That's, that's so lovely. I only have the old school covers getting rid of them. Never getting rid of them. Definitely keep hold of them. They're so special. Oh my god, same. My Harry Potter books are dilapidated now. Loved the old artwork. I don't know why there was just something more magical about them and original. Um, I've forgotten what I'm doing. Oh yeah, I'm trying to get rid of stuff. Three years? Wow. I guess that's like, I hope you like, well, I hope you get down the aisle soon, if that's what you want to do. I mean, I guess COVID has affected people. I went to a wedding over Christmas and they had postponed three times due to COVID, which is just so stressful. So stressful. I couldn't even imagine it. We got married in 2019, so, um... And we were going to wait. We were going to wait until um, 2020 just because I thought the year sounded better. Don't ask me why. Um, getting a house and then married, then a dog. Oh, that sounds like you have it all planned out. I love that. The ha Harry Potter series has so many nice covers. I have seen a few nice ones. I've seen ones with like... Um, what's it called like where it's like gold leaf gold embossed or like it's shiny basically and shiny things are pretty so we like that good job you didn't wait yeah exactly it would have been a major headache oh yeah I forgot Tiffy as well you made yourself you finally got down the aisle as well yeah Where's the, um, the wild log? That's what I wanted. Yeah, uh, Tiffy's wedding looks so cute. She, lo she looked gorgeous in her dress. <laughs> My parents aren't best pleased with the idea of their grandchild being a sausage dog. Well... I guess my grand, my parents are 
grandparents to your two cats, so there we go. Hi, Froggo Fragment, welcome in. So glad you could be here as well. Oh yeah, things would have been super hard. I haven't, I realised, I haven't actually used any of these snow persons on my island. So I'm determined to get a couple in while we're just making this. And that's a tree, isn't it? Not a bush. Okay, let's move things around a bit then. Hi, Sarah, how are you? Me and Sky getting married in July 2nd, 22, and I engaged to, got engaged to her last year. Wow. Well, there's a lot of love in the t in the chat today. Anyone with sausage dogs, if you're a Discord member, please send them to Amanda. <laughs> I don't. If anyone owns a sausage dog, I don't think they're going to be giving it away. <laughs> Sorry to break your. Oh gosh, I didn't think about that manicule. Having a cross-border wedding, that's, yeah. AJ, did I say hello to you? If I didn't, hi. Oh. Nope, that is not the way this rug should be. I fit, do you know what, when I said earlier about I didn't really love this island, I think it's because there's not many like cute seating areas and things like that, which I'm so used to. Maybe that's what's put me off a bit. No, you forgot little of me. No, don't do that to me. You'll make me feel bad. <laughs> I, I can never forget about you. I'm still your entrance to your island is still imprinted on my brain because it was that cute so adorable aj if you're in the discord go and check out aj's kid core farm entrance because wow that was beautiful oh okay lisa bye um where is I just literally had a garden rock in front of me. Oh, thank you. Making a European forest... No, wait, let me try that again. Making a forest European core. What about, like, doing a log cabin of some kind? Oh, Emily! Amazing! Yes, please do that. We would be would provide constructive criticism. Although I'm sure it doesn't need it. I'm sure it doesn't need it. I'm sure it's going to be amazing. And Oriel, that's me as well. Oh, you've gone. You've you've skipped past spring and just gone direct to summer. Nice. You must have really missed the green. I have so many little areas I'm stuck on. Well, we can help. We can help. Sarah, please tell me that you haven't finished your winter island already. If so, my expectations, your super quickness has just blown my mind again. I don't even play this game. I just live vicariously through my partner. I'm off to watch football. Have an easy Sunday, guys and girls. Aww. Oh, Amanda, it sounds like you've got a good egg there. Definitely a good egg. Enjoy your football, Shane, and thank you again for the super chat. And Molly is adorable. Hi Sophia, welcome to the channel. I hope you enjoy it. Bo has a log cab cabin. Yes, he does. And some cute fishing areas would be nice as well. A 
Okay, this will look better when the stuff has grown in, I promise. Or I hope anyway. <laughs> she says, she says. Right. Let's be done with this. Pick up my portable stuff. Head empty, no thoughts. <laughs> Why? Okay, let's grab a... I need to put some foliage up here. Oh, Amanda. Let me grab a ladder. You would think after playing this game for so many months, I guess it's almost... Hang on, wait. When did the game come out? 2020. Okay, so near, playing the game for like two years and I've still not picked up the fact that I should have a ladder on me at most times. Um, but hey. Right. This is another little area. It literally just needs some, yeah, foliage. And cliff decorating and stuff. And then I really do think it is going to be a matter of deciding if I do put anything on the beaches or not. I'm thinking it's probably going to be a hard no. Maybe just some shells and some a sprinkling of, of flowers and things. Maybe some rocks. Hi, Shiny. Enjoy your lurk. Thank you for being here. Um, Hyacinth. That's a good one. So, I apologise. This isn't going to be the most groundbreaking stream ever. Banish the beaches. They're not worthy of time and efforts. You're true. You're, you're not wrong, AJ. You're not wrong. I should... I went around last night and I actually put some vines on here. Um, on this island. Um, which was different. They look so nice in the snow. I'm... I'm not going to lie. They do look really nice in the snow. Hi, Tanya. Welcome in. Hope you enjoyed the stream. And Chloe, I'm terrible at making snow person, uh, snow, snowmen in the game. I'm, I'm so bad. I don't think I would be very good at it. I don't mind decorating beaches, if I'm honest. Um, but I just want to get the island done. So, maybe we'll ditch that. Oh, welcome to Daisy member, Anna. Thank you so much. Um, don't forget to check out your emotes. Um, and also, as a Daisy member, remember to check the um, community page. I post things on there, like video votes, etc. And if you're in the Discord, or if you're not, please join us and we can set you up with your role there as well. Just being here and watching is so good for the soul right now, Flares Crossing. Aw, thank you, Dale. The law of the island is the green grass is untouched land and the beach is the European part. Interesting. I have two unpopular Animal Crossing opinions. I love decorating the beaches and I like Rocket. Rocket is definitely, is definitely an unpopular opinion. I'm not gonna lie. I love really good decorated beaches, but it's so hard to do. I agree. That's a good one. That's a good thing. Um, Bella, I'll probably do it off stream just because I've got a lot of decorating to do. Um, and welcome back, Lisa. Um, I totally have random stuff that I definitely don't put a random tulip here oh stonks i hope you feel better soon i'm sorry i feel really bad for you it must be so hard when you feel that unwell and you can't focus on anything i really hate it um how do i find inspo for my builds so um Sometimes I find it from like people in the community. So I won't lie, S Sweet Magnolia Sarah and her town islands definitely helped inspire this island. Um, because if you haven't already seen her town islands, you should go and watch them because they are amazing. I've toured a couple of her islands on um, my channel and yeah, they are mind blowing. 
Um, I also, like, if I think about things, like, maybe I'll think about, like, my garden centre. Um, my husband actually suggested, why don't you do a garden centre? So then I just started building and kind of see where it took me. Um, but yeah, a lot of the time I do just kind of try and go with the flow and see what happens. It's just fun that way if you think of an idea and then go from that. Um, let's get rid of some of this stuff that I won't be using. Gladys was precious yesterday, birthday time. Oh, was it Gladys's birthday yesterday? Oh, I didn't realise that. Um, no, that can stay. That can go. Rasha is my birthday twin, April. Oh, Sarah. <laughs> oh, you could definitely have had a better birthday twin. That is actually sad. Oh, well, stay hydrated, stonks, and yeah, look after yourself. And hopefully we will see your funny self back again soon. Oh, thank you, Tanya. Nice, MGS. That's a nice one. i tell you something that I haven't actually used that much on this island is... Um, I just saw one. What was it? Oh, tiny libraries. I used to be obsessed with them. Um, my birthday twin is... Sky. No, is it Sky? Yeah, I think it's Sky. Who I, I'm not mad about that. I think that's a pretty good birthday twin. She's cute. And I've had her before. I, I don't... I'm pretty sure butty... butties? Butterflies don't live in, in winter. But we'll see. This area feels a bit awkward. Hi, I'm about to buy Animal Crossing in Nintendo. I'm kind of nervous on preparing my theme and stuff for my island. So what's your opinion on finding the right theme for your island? Um, so I think the main thing to do is think about what makes you happy. Because if you're going to try something that you're not going to enjoy, you're just going to kind of get to the point where you're, you're, you're facing a blank wall, a blank canvas, and you don't know where to go with your island. So I definitely just think about what you enjoy. You don't have to do a particular theme, particularly if it's like your first island. Maybe just get used to the game, just start decorating, start start experimenting. Um, I know I use themes and a lot of people do, but people just do what builds they enjoy doing. So don't forget about that. Please don't feel pressured to stick to a particular kind of theme. But yeah, if you come up with an idea, then go for it. I think having custom designs and things like that definitely kind of help shape your island as well so bear that in mind um but yeah have yeah exactly as tanya says have fun and take your time that is the way to go there is no rush um although it may seem like i'm rushing now because i'm desperate to get out on the snow that's purely so that i can work on something else because i'm just a yeah, I get super excited when I have new plans in my head. Which I guess isn't a bad thing. Bunny is cute as well. When my island is done, how can you tour my island? So Froggo Fragment, I have a... I think it's in the description for the stream as well. Um, I do have a link to a form where you can submit your um, island to be toured. If you want to do that, you don't have to. Ah, oh, no problem, and thank you. You have three unpopular opinions. I will not say the third because it will anger 99% of people. MGS, you'll have to whisper it to me later because now I need to know what your third unpopular opinion is. I want to know. Oh, what did you say, Christina? Sorry. Just let me know what you said and I will reply to you. Uh, good morning, Reese. Welcome in. Oh. I 
I think the bad side about this is I feel like I have to fill up every piece on my island, but I think just back here there's not actually that much going on. I don't know how much you would actually see of it, but we'll, we'll decorate it anyway. So it's done. It is done then. <laughs> she is going to spill some tea. I kind of want to hear the tea, but I don't want an angry chat at the same time. <laughs> but... I mean, everyone's welcome to their opinions, so you need to go ahead with it. Oh, Amanda. Amanda, thank you so much for the super chat. I love watching your streams and videos. It makes me happy and brightens my day. You guys, you are the sweetest couple. Adorable. Right. Hi, it's been a while. Hi, Mia. Welcome in. Um, I'm doing my homework right now and thought it would be a good time to listen in. Well, I hope we can give you some comfort company while um you're doing your homework hi rain hello happy sunday to you rain hope you're well oh no please say it mgs please and christina welcome to becoming a tulip member again don't forget to check out your emotes and things um i don't stream every day um i stream probably a couple of times a week um just because i do work full time and things so trying to um get it fit it in with that is kind of hard work hi shannon welcome in hello i'm a bit stuck i went the wrong way welcome back totoro okay guys um to those who are just joining um if you've watched one of my streams before if or if you haven't um we like to make little fun adverts um, and there is a new one, which I said I would play again because some people missed it earlier when we got to 100 likes, so... <laughs> oh no! Danny, don't go through that co I hope it's not that. I hope it's not that they hate barrels. Currently doing homework about antenatal classes? Oh! Are you studying to be a midwife? That's interesting. Um, I feel like feel that work, I work full time too, but I look forward to when I get home and can just chill. Oh, definitely me too. It is like that's what I like about streams because I did apart from the stream the other day when I was trying to do a build in thirty minutes. Um, the um, that was a bit of a that was a bit hard work. Um, yeah it is generally just to relax and chill and chat with you guys so that's really nice <laughs> oh april <laughs> that's so funny yeah the, no one needs hatred towards the barrels please please guys don't upset me don't make me cry <laughs> I do child development for GCSE. Oh, that's such, wow, that's a really nice career choice. Well, chilling to the stream while decorating my house. Good luck with your house, Laura. Oh, Tanya, there's nothing wrong with being a middle school teacher. I admire you because that sounds like a really hard age. To be honest, I kind of like the barrels though. Um, GDG, if you like the barrels, you're in the right place, 100%. We like the barrels here. We love the barrels. Not even like, it's a love. Um, Daisy, there should be a description, um, a link in the description to the Discord. Oh, thank you, welcome to the channel. Okay, I do actually have some tidying up to do as well. I work in retail, no clue what I want to do. Lol, bow factory ready, maybe. Well, you know, Emily, I work in the barrel business. I can hook you up. I don't work in a barrel factory for those who actually believe that I do. Um, but yeah, there we go. Welcome to the barrel community. That is exactly what it is. Good morning, Heather. How are you? 
Does the Discord still have an age limit? Um, we try and ask for 16-ish plus. Um, just not that there's anything bad on it. Um, but just because we want to be careful and protect the younger members in the community. Oh, hi Eugene. What reaction are you going to give me today? Dozing? Oh, so I can take a Sunday afternoon nap? Nice. Oh. Oh, that's good. I'm glad you have a good class. It's the customization options that win me over. The wooden partitions, yeah. I think the wooden partitions, I like the fact that they are they are definitely customizable. That's one bonus. Um, have I got a coconut still? I just woke up for some reason. My body will not sleep in past 9.30. Oh no! Hi Joe, you did manage to catch up. You did. How are you? Thank you, GDG. I don't even have the strength to be a student in high school, never mind a teacher. I thought about it, maybe I thought about becoming a teacher maybe for like a second or two. And then I kind of chickened out. I think I wouldn't have the dis not the discipline. Um, I think I would struggle to be strict with people and I probably would give in if someone did something wrong. I I'd give someone a detention and then two seconds later I'd probably like, no, I feel bad and take away the detention or something. I just thought of something that you would love. You should rename your... Oh, I should rename my... What? I wake up at 8 a.m. on my day off. Me too. I finished work. What time did I finish work? Like three o'clock last night and I was up at like half nine. So I'm definitely going to try and have a lion tomorrow. Hi, Jack. Welcome in. Poncho. Poncho is so cute. Poncho is adorable. You should get him. Unless you have all the villagers that you want. You should rename your top deer to... B E R E. What does that mean, Lisa? 20 years? Wow. <laughs> Barrel besties. I love that. Oh my gosh. Barrel besties. Hey, Canada Crossing. Do you want to be part of the Barrel besties? 100 likes? Oh, yay. Okay, two secs. Let me just sort these flowers out and then I'll play it again. I'll give you a minute to get ready. Is everyone watching the screen? Because we are going to play a new advert shortly. What inspired you to start a Maker channel? Um, well, my husband bought me a capture card for Christmas a couple years ago. And then after he bought it for me, I kind of had to do something with it. So that's why we're here now. I'm a primary teacher. There's not many barrels involved though, so I'm not sure you'd like it. I'm sure there's a way to incorporate barrels, Chloe. <laughs> yes, okay, so let's go. Right, here we go. Three, two, one. Hello, totally awesome people. You can call me Hav if you want. Today I'm coming at you with an offer that will blow your mind. Are you wanting to escape the razzle-dazzle of the city? Then come and join us at my totally chill community co-op. The vibe is so mellow you'll spend your time horizontal. There are some super groovy residents to welcome you. If you have any questions bouncing around in your noggin, then get in touch. Peace out, man. Okay, there we go. Is the game audio playing as well? No. Is it? I think it is. Nothing says romance like a capture card. <laughs> well, we could be barrel besties and partition pals. Are you not feeling this April? <laughs> Yay, you got to see it. I hope it was worth it. Peace out, man. Your husband's made... <laughs> oh no. 
seductive was not the look that he was going for. He was trying to sound like chill and relaxed. Um, now I'm slightly concerned. <laughs> oh dear. I, I hope that's a compliment. He'll make, you'll make him paranoid and he won't do any more videos for me. Or voiceovers, I'll have to find someone else. Okay, so we've done this area. We've done it up behind the cliffs. There is nothing kind of chilled out about a Yorkshireman's accent. Let's put it that way. Oh, I need to get a bike rental sign here. And I also need some cycling helmets. I don't think I have any. Let's see if Able Sisters is selling them. I highly doubt it. No, no, no. Um, he, we're from the UK, Lisa. We both are. <laughs> I can't, but I feel like, yeah. Okay, good. Um, hats. Oh, oh, no way. That's such good luck. Okay, we're gonna buy this. The new subscribers members name Barrel Besties. I'm from North Yorkshire, although I sound posh apparently. Well, Amanda, um, so I'm from the South originally, um, the Southwest, and um, my sister likes to make fun of me and says that every, that I'm turning into a Yorkshire person, my voice. And I feel like North Yorkshire is pretty posh generally. A lot um, posher than West Yorkshire. It may snow here where I live in the US. Oh, nice. Everyone loves a bit of snow. Where is... Oh, no. Poncho is moving in. Yay, Emily. Good choice. This cycling helmet with this dress is a whole look. I think I'm setting fashion trends here. Oh, Dale, no way. Your dress is so cottagecore vibe. That is what I'm going for. I'm so happy I brought you guys barrel besties. Yes, Lisa. I'm from the Southwest too. Emma and I are poshos. Don't forget Emily as well. Emily is a posho. I'm not the best at geography. I'm sure I live in the Northwest. I like the Northwest accent. The accent's fun. There's so many different accents. It always kind of blows my mind that England has so many different accents for such a small place. Uh, where is that hat gone? You're in Asia? How cool. Philippines? Nice. We all just well spoken. Yeah. Uh, where did you get that dress and how do I get it? So it's a custom design. <laughs> the helmet and the dress, Chef Kiss. <laughs> the, if you search brown race collar in your um, custom design thing, then you'll be able to find it that way. Chloe, that's the assumption that all kind of northerners make. I feel like when I first moved up here, everyone was like, um, oh, you're from the Southwest, you must be posh. I'm really not posh, but um, yeah, that's what they like to say. Your accents are so distinct, not like here in the US. Oh, hi Giorgio from Italy. I'm from the States, love the accents. I love accents, especially Americans. I like the, the Irish accent and Scottish accents. I think they're really nice. Um, I need a sign, what are they called? A plain sh shop sign? I, don't, I need a sign, but I don't even know if I have a 11 rain. Wow. I'm guessing when you have um, 11 different languages, they kind of like amalgamate together. So that must be hard. Oh, Daisy. Thank you so much for becoming a Daisy member. Um, if you just joined the Discord then and it's linked to your YouTube already, then it should... It should... Um, 
set it up nicely for you um but if not then just um send me a message and i'll sort it out for you but yeah thank you and don't forget to check out your emotes as well thank you alex i've just moved from north yorkshire from richmond it was too rural <laughs> lovely part of the world that is far away from us yorkshire is just such a big area Um, Flares, are you going to look at my designs in live? Um, it's going to be on free time, Bella. Do you play Roblox? I don't play Roblox. Sorry. Oh my, we have three and that's already horror. Can I... F to find a good paid job? I can't imagine 11. Oh, Anxuna, where are you from? Oh, did you say Germany? What other languages in Germany? Because I know Switzerland has different languages. I couldn't speak the other day. Instead of saying dishwasher, I normally said, pronounced like dishwasher. <laughs> Do you know you don't have an accent until you leave your city and town? Yes, definitely. Oh, Chloe, you're from Devon originally. That's where I'm from. I'm from Belgium, so we have Dutch. French and German. Ah, yes, that makes sense. Um, what was I doing? Oh, I'm gonna find a code for a bike rental. I find it so funny that most people think the original language in Switzerland is Swiss German, but it's not. But it's not Swiss German. Doesn't exist. It's just German with a bunch of funny accents. <laughs> um. I know my friend is Swiss French side, so she speaks a lot of, she speaks French more than German, but isn't there kind of like an amalgamation language? What's it called? I can't remember. Uh, bike rental sign, that's what I'm doing. Yay, I could not decide if I wanted to be a Daisy member since I am Daisy, but my friend said it makes more sense. Aww. It does make sense that you're a daisy for daisy. <laughs> right, let's find a cute bike rental sign. That one's... Mm, this one's pretty cute. It's pretty standard, but we'll go for this one. At work the other day, I told my children they were having a multi day and TA nearly wet herself. They don't use... Oh, a mufti day? What's a mufti? I don't use that word either. I had to learn a few words, so when I moved up here, like ginnel. What's the other one that they use for ginnel? Oh, Heather. Hi, Rochelle. How are you? Oh, a non-school uniform day. Oh, okay. No! Fuddle was another word that I used. I'd never heard that word before. Apparently that means, like... Is that just me? Painting was super close to where I was from. We used to go there when I was a child. Um, I'm fine. Too early. I'm not surprised it is early, especially on a Sunday. Uh, hi, Kaylee, as well. Yeah, so a fuddle is like a food cuddle. Because so everyone brings in like a, a different sort of food. I'm sure there's other words as well that I've never heard before. It's kind of hard to explain over chat for it to make sense sometimes, yeah. Wow, it's such a so small world. How old am I? Um, I probably sound a lot younger than I am, I won't lie. Um, I'm in my late 20s. Um, and hi, Lolly. Hi, Coffee with Lolly. That is a very appropriate username for a nice early stream on a Sunday. Okay, here we go. I know it's green and red, but the, the options for the cycling hats are not great. Hi Tanaka, how are you? 
Lovely to see you here. Okay, there we go. We have a bike rental sign now. Let's pick this up. Right. Time to run aimlessly around this island and see what areas need changing. I think maybe we need a chair here. That would add something there. Imagine doing this without having a portable storage shed. Hi, Katie Bum. Uh, Brum, even. <laughs> Sorry. Um, welcome in. Um, where is... You always same wear. Should I change my outfit with that? I like this outfit. A potluck. Yes. Yes, you did, Lisa. It's an odd question, but do you think the Sunday marks the beginning of... At the end of the week or the beginning? Well, for my channel, I kind of treat it as like a beginning. Bye, Ellie. Thank you so much for being here. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Um, for the channel, I do kind of treat it as the beginning of the week. Kind of, but like in an office. Like sandwiches and things like that. Hi, Nietzsche. Good morning. How are you? No, I haven't been playing it. I keep seeing it pop up on my Twitter. Can you explain it to me? Because I'm very intrigued. Oh, it should work. Is it... Are you trying to get it from the description or from um, the pinned comment? Isabel says it's the start of a new week in her announcements on Sundays. Well, if Isabel says it's on Sundays, then it must be on Sundays. That doesn't look very good. Bacon sandwich for lunch. What about me? What did I have for lunch? Oh. So, um, you all know what fish fingers are, right? Well, they do like vegetarian fingers, which have got like, um pieces of vegetables in <laughs> um and I had some of them for lunch oh no neat so I'm really sorry oh try the pinned comment um Katie um I might just need to update that Rochelle it's a very simple word game you guess a five letter word green means you're right oh do you know what Rochelle we have a um we have a game show like that in the UK. It's called Lingo. If you look up Lingo, I feel like I need a little takeaway coffee here. Um, yeah, if you look up Lingo, the TV show, that sounds exactly what it is. I can't believe they've made a game out of it. Or they've, someone's either like stolen the idea or um, they've ripped the idea from the game show. Um, I wonder what way round it is. But it sounds fun. Oh, we got canned coffee. Um, she means her fur babies. Gina. I hope... I hope he's okay. And Danielle, good morning. How are you? It's really fun. There's only one word per day. Oh, okay. Okay, so here's the way to the library. What theme do you usually use on your island? Um, I use a mixture. I try and change it up every time I do a new island, if I'm honest. This is my basic peninsula because I didn't know what else to do there. I have a feeling I need to do some gardening up here. Can I get up here? Nope. Oh dear. Anyone need some white flowers? Oh, dearie, dearie me. Okay, let's fix this. This is not pretty sight. Uh, where can I put my bin down? Okay, let's try and clear it up first of all. I got today's word in four guests as well. Honestly, that TV show, it, sometimes I'm like, how how did you guess that word? Have I been on live? Um... I've been on live for about uh, 1 hour 20. 
So I've got another maybe like 40, 50 minutes to go. It's only felt like 10 minutes. I know. That's how it feels like for me as well. Time goes so quickly. How would you suggest doing a mood board for an island? So when I do my mood boards, Amanda, I pick out a path, maybe like a path or two if you want two paths. Um, some fabric patterns. Um, they're quite important. I feel like they really help build it up as well. Um, what else do I do? Um, some tile, single tile patterns, finding out them. I choose a stool design because I'm guaranteed to incorporate a stool somewhere on my island. Maybe not so much now, um, but previously before 2.0, um, flower, filler, tiles, leaves, um, just generally things that you think you're going to use, maybe some, some simple panel designs as well. Um, just depends. Um, just try and incorporate them and then just put them all down together um, and just see how it looks. It's quite fun to do, honestly. It's a bit time consuming if you're doing lots of them, um, which is what I did for the video, but um, obviously you probably won't, will just be doing one, so it'll be a bit more um, manageable. And thank you, Katie, for becoming a Tulip member. Don't forget to check out your emotes. And also, if you're in the Discord, then we can set up your role on there as well. I just joined this live to have in the background, but I haven't touched my homework since I joined. Sorry, Mia. Oh, good, Katie. Thank you. They are annoying, so annoying. Bye Tanya, have a good time at church. I don't, this is the downsides of not putting down transparent code designs. You end up with flowers everywhere. I didn't mean to put the trash can away. Um, I will have to get it back out. I think we're okay for now. If we just play around with where the flowers are, we might be able to save most of them. No, that's not good there. Um, I've got a tulip here. That purple mum definitely won't be staying there. I think. Will it let me? It should let me put thing here. Oh, no. You won't see that one, so I'm just going to put another one next to it. Oh. How odd. Didn't let me put anything there. Let me put a flower there. Strange. I'm starting to wonder if I have, you know, the glowy moss boulder? That might look quite nice here. I don't know if I have it unlocked, though. Let's have a look. Um, I don't know how far down it is. Um, oh, I don't have the recipe for it. Oh, no, I do. Here it is. Glowing Moss 15. What's your island name and why did you name it that? So this island is called Azalea because initially it was going to be like a garden city like in spring, summertime. Um, but I changed my mind. I started doing that island and then I changed my mind pretty quickly on it. Um, and it was approaching winter so I just decided to change it into the winter island. Um, so yeah, it kind of fitted with that. I didn't want to restart it because it was going to be too much work. Hey Joanna, how are you? Are you going to, once you finish this island, are you going to flatten or restart? I'm going to restart um, so I can save the dream address. Um, yeah, I just think that would be easier. Do you know what your next theme might be? It's definitely going to be something springy and green. I just like the idea of that. I used the Sailor Moon opening in my, as my town tune. 
Oh, nice. Oh, that reminds me. I need to set a flag. I have no idea what flag I'm going to go with. I forgot last time and then I just ended up randomly setting something. There's the trash can. And I'm going to need some custom designs. Did I? Custom design kits. Did I put them away? Can I? Oh, where are they? If you could change your island name to match your theme, what would I name it? Oh, that's a hard one. I don't honestly know. I feel like I'm not very good at... Oh, I need the glow moss as well. That would be kind of important. Um, I'm not very good at names. My names are pretty generic. I feel. Are you making island? Um, I will probably reset my island live on stream. Because I always feel like it's fun to do together. Um, I don't know why. Last time I, I... And last time I reset it on stream and... I pretty much took the second island that I got, um, which was a bit disappointing. I hate naming islands too. But my island, my names for my Happy Home Paradise builds, they are so basic. <laughs> it's so bad. My island is called Ariati. I'm so glad that I recently restarted taking it slow. That's a good idea. A good idea and I just realized I'm gonna need to custom design that. Hi Caroline Rose, how are you? Good morning. I hope you're having a good weekend. My island is called Enchanted and I've had the same island name since the release. I've still not completed it. There's nothing wrong with that because I feel like you're playing it as you want to play it and things change over the time. You might decide to do something different and just go back over and change things so yes. Yeah. Oh, thank you, Lolly. My island is just called Forest because I would go with a new theme of Forest Call. I like that. Good night from. Good night. I don't know your name, but good night to those of you that are in Japan. My island name is Avalon. That's cute. My island is named Cake Cliff. Do you like cake by any chance, Pandora? Because if so, I think that's a, a good a good um, name for it. I did Barrowly. I've played it a couple times now, so I probably won't be playing it again. Um, but you can obviously go back and look at the stream um, and watch it that way. Goodbye, Froggo. Thank you for being here. Let's have a look. Get some... Okay, so we need to tidy this up as well is a mess. I'm good. My husband tested positive for COVID on Friday. Oh no. So I'm quarantined in my guest bedroom. No symptoms so far. I hope it stays that way, Caroline. And I hope your husband's okay as well. At least you can get plenty of Animal Crossing time in. My current islands are Magnolia and Primrose. Um, but those are amazing names, Sarah. They're really cute names. And I think they fit you perfectly as well. I think flower names are pretty good to go with. I won't lie. I feel like there's so much spectrum for different themes now because of the 2.0 update. Oh, really? 100%. You're so right, Amanda. That totally is. I like the desert island that I saw before. I mean, I've seen desert islands pre... Um, 2.0, but um, they just were totally elevated, that theme. Totally elevated. I changed my name. Oh, thank you, Tanaka. Sorry, I thought it might be you, but it gets confusing when there's people with um, more than um, one people with those characters in their names. Um, I honestly can't see what else I need to decorate. Um... Okay, <laughs> I do, I haven't actually touched any of my interiors. Cleo is gorgeous, I love her. I named mine Tabe Masu because at the time I was struggling to remember the difference between Nomi Masu and Tabe Masu while learning Japanese. That's one way to remember it. Do you have any tips for waterscaping? Um, I do. 
I think it's just a matter of try and avoid like harsh corners and edges and things um, because that just doesn't look very natural um, and kind of change things up like move them around so it flows and try and get an idea of where your end point is going to be that kind of helps as well he's having very mild symptoms just congestion a small cough nothing more but we're opposite side of the house so that's good 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 have you ever started an island and regretted the theme after choosing a couple of yes well no not that i regretted it but like um i just struggled with it so i gave up on it Oh, I'm glad you guys like that tour. It was fun to film, definitely, because I haven't done, seen anything like that before. So it was very different. Very different to what I normally do. And Danny, what's wrong with your island? Are you... I, I, I know you're, talk, you're asking for yourself. <laughs> No, angels are so adorable. We put them everywhere. I just thought they would like a nice filler. Oh no. Okay, are we good again now? We should be good now. Let me just see. Are we... Okay, we should be alright. I think we're good. I have enough trouble trying to name a cafe and restaurant, let alone a new island name. That's me also. <laughs> Random question, do you like having in paradises that are one colour? Yeah, I've seen a few nice ones. Is your voice, is your island flat besides a few places? Um, let's have a look. Oh, Lolly, I have. I did um, Azalea. Um, I did Azalea's house in green. That was so much fun. There's a picture of it on my Twitter. I don't think I have it to hand. But yeah, that was a lot of fun to do. I liked the snow for a month long after that. I went back to spring and summer in the game so pretty. Yeah, my island is pretty flat. Um, there's not much terraforming on this island at all. Um, yeah. So if you're scared of terraforming, you if you don't like terraforming, you don't have to terraform. Honestly. Oh. I'm just I'm shocked at how few custom designs I've used for this island I don't know why it's been so few but normally I'm struggling so much to fit the custom designs in but look Look at these empty slots down here. These I haven't used. I've used these two and this one. But the water I haven't used. These I haven't used because these were part of the extra one. Oh. I thought it was going to be your forest core. I thought it was going to be your elegant core one. Oh, I love forest core. Do you know what you should do? Maybe come, maybe have a brainstorming session. Come up with the areas that you think that you could work on. So you like have like hiking trails. Um, someone, I think it was CH teacher in one of my streams. She had done a um, like a camping grounds with like toilets, a whole toilet block, block and stuff. It looks so cool. Um, I'm trying to think what else for us, Corey like a really nice terraforming area with some sunken waterfalls and things would be nice and make it like a visitor attraction i don't know that's sounding more like a camping kind of island hi brooklyn welcome in you got the mum's cushion nice totoro I'm making my island with OG path design. Not even going to use the 2.0 items. Oh, that will be a challenge. Why am I putting down Christmas designs? <laughs> Whoops. If you reset your theme, what you do. Um, I'm going to do, yeah, a land bridge as well. That's a good idea as well. 
Um, I'm going to do a spring island with green, like a vintage element to it. What is going on here? Stop. Camping is for a stop. It is, isn't it? That is what it is. Okay, good. Then yeah, do all of that, Danny. Have a big brainstorming session. There is, I've seen, I have seen so many nice forest core islands over the years. Over the years. Sounds like we've been here for absolutely centuries. Um, but yeah, over the time. Um, I'm trying to think of some off the top of my head that you might be able to get inspiration from. Yeah, so now with 2.0 we have so many more. You will be fine. You've got this. We all know that you're very talented. So don't doubt yourself. A little Fleur's pep talk there for you. It might not have helped, but I'm trying. <laughs> it's not really hard. I got a lot of cottage core items from pre 2.0. That's true. I feel like that was some of my inventory items as well. Do you go to Treasure Islands? I do go to Treasure Islands. I normally visit ones that are on Twitch. Um, and when I go, I don't really tend to, unless it's for a specific item, I don't really tend to write a list or something. But I'm normally visiting when I'm going to do a particular build. Um, or I need it for like a video. Um, so I will make a list then. Um, but I just, I like visually seeing things. So I... If I see something and I like it and I know it'll fit the theme on my island, I just kind of pick it up. Um, I'm a hoarder, uh, a massive hoarder. So on my other Switch, um, I'm nearly at the 4K max for um, the storage. So that's not good. Probably because the majority of it is filled with simple panels from my old builds. I don't know, but we'll see. Flares, do you have any ideas for Cottage Core Island? I love Cottage Core as well. Cottage Core is so cute. I should put a snow angel there. Oh, would it have fit here? Oh, it probably would have done. How do you put the border around your stream? So I use OBS to do it, and it's an overlay. I got COVID and I feel horrible right now. Oh no, Pandora, I hope you feel better soon. Okay, I think this area is all done as well. Okay, let me, can I get through here? Who do you wish for your spring island villager? Um, I wouldn't mind having Molly in there. Um, the downside to it is, um, I haven't decided how I'm going to work it because this is the island that I have. Okay, yeah. <laughs> oh, Chris. Chris, that, yeah, that's a hoarder. <laughs> that is pretty bad. Um, Daisy, how much longer are you going to stream for? I normally go for about two hours. Um, we're at 1.41 now, so we've got a little bit left, maybe like half an hour or so. Um, I might start working on the interior because honestly, I don't know what else to do. I mean, I could fix that up a bit, but it's like behind, so I don't know. I won't, Danny. I'll wait until you're back. Don't worry. <laughs> I feel like a lot of the areas, the filler areas are kind of done. I have no idea what the flyover looks like. So that will be interesting. Might have to get it at some point. Right, let's go inside. Um, I think I'm not going to decorate all my house, but I might do the main room just because I wanted to do... This is going to seem a bit weird, but I do want to do like a, a Christmassy main room and then block it all off with so no one can get there. Um... I would say it was like a winter town island. I don't really have any kind of specific, yeah, winter town, um, rustic winter town, I guess. Um, 
yeah, that's kind of it. Oh, whoops. It wasn't the best idea to plant all the flowers around resident services. Oh no, have they all spread? Um, Tanaka, I love Molly. Molly is my favourite. Oh, that looks weird in here. What theme are you doing after this one? Definitely do gonna do um, some sort of winter, not winter, spring island. Um, no, I didn't. I didn't, Naya. I'm really annoyed about that. I might just leave him there because he's on the beach. So I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna worry about him. I've not done anything to his house. He's just literally plonked in the middle of the beach. I do like doing into. See, I get why people do it, April. Because it's a lot of work to decorate your whole house. I do like doing um, interiors. But with Happy Home Paradise at the moment, I just feel like it's a lot. It's a lot, a lot. I might not get this finished on stream, but we'll see how it goes. Oh, that's interesting. Ooh, I need to make some more partitions, methinks. It looks like a giant flower field made with white flowers. White flowers are my favourite though, for sure. Oh, bye Diamond Angel, thank you for stopping by. I love... <laughs> This um, wallpaper is so cute. I'm going to have to... I forget. We're not at Harv's Island now. Actually going to have to do some crafting. What a pain. Where did I get that wallpaper? Um, I'm just wondering, do I prefer that one instead? That's kind of cute. Um, it's one of the DIYs, I think, or I'm sure that's what it is. It's one of the like Christmassy DIY things. Snowflakes, do I have any? Oh, we do. How did you put the wallpaper design over onto the simple panel? I've never seen that before. So it's not a simple panel. It's a partition um, that you get from completing so many houses in Happy Home Paradise. Um, Nico gives you the DIY recipe for it. So, um, yeah. Oh, hi, Rowan. How are you? Have you ever seen the show Survivor? I, ha I No, I don't think I have. We don't, it's not really aired here in the UK. I love that wallpaper, it's my favorite. Definitely one of mine as well, for winter especially. A simple pillar, or the wood pillar. Okay, so we need wood, hardwood, softwood, wood and clay. Wood. Okay, there we go. You get it from the snowman, don't you? Yeah, I think so. I like Francine. Who, which one's? Who's Francine's sister? I can't remember her name. Good, thank you, Rowan. Okay, and now wooden pillars. I love the wallpaper, but I have such a difficult time. That is exactly what I was just thinking, Slippy. I'm not sure if this one really works. That's it, Naya. Thank you. I knew I knew it in my head. Oh, wow. Hi, Lunica. That is super early. Let's customize these. I think the darker wood, maybe? The dark wood? Or do we go blue and white? And I have have I crafted the wrong one? We could have gone with the simple pillars. 
clay and stone. Okay, let's let's craft one of these and see which one looks better. Hi, Creeper Amy, welcome in. Oh, Creeper Army, sorry. I really need to be wearing my glasses. <laughs> Although, I'm gonna blame it on that. I do need to wear them. So sad you can't place the pillars outside. I know. I think the decorative pillars that you can place outside are just a smidgen too small, which disappoints me. No, that's a wooden pillar. Okay, yes. I'm gonna go with blue and white. I might regret this later. But we'll see how it goes. Uh, where's my partition? Thank you. How about a reading nook? Yeah, reading nook could work. Oh my gosh. It's currently 3.13 here as well. Um, I wish we could put pillars and island counters outside. Oh no, Bella, that's not very nice. I'm sure they don't mean it. Oh, you're one hour ahead, Rowan. It's definitely it's sad when the afternoon goes. It's like the weekend's disappearing away. Why am I not decorating in this mode? That would be so much easier. I wish you could craft in this mode as well. It'd make life just a tad easier. Oh, oh. Okay, there we go. Right, now to try and figure out what to do here. Do I actually, oh guys, the patchwork stuff is so cute. These are cute, these are cute. I'm just gonna drop down stuff that I think is cute and then we'll try and make it look okay. Moroccan sofa could work. It's gonna be a cozy Sunday, that's true. I think everyone deserves a nice cozy Sunday. Um, I've just realized I am gonna need to do partitions all the way around the outside because of the other doors, which could be a bit annoying. It needs to be like that. Okay. Bye Amanda, thank you so much for stopping by. And thank you so much for the super chat and yeah, just being here. It's been lovely to have you and spend time with you. Ooh, do you know what would look nice in here? I don't, oh, I don't have them. I was thinking the Moroccan lights would look so cute in here. But I don't have any. I just want the rooms of my house to be t tiny like in Happy in Paradise. <laughs> I think it's this room that is the worst, if I'm honest. Because of all the doors, I don't like that at all. I'm going to have to craft quite a few of these. Oh look, Rochelle's just signed on to Happy um, Animal Crossing. You have the white one. The white... Which white one? For the Moroccan? Do I? Let's have a look. Oh, we do! Yes! Time to order lots of them. Thank you, Nietzsche. And thank you, Liana. Hi, Dana. Oh, I did pass it? Oh yeah, there it is. 
Okay, cool. I have one. Um, I think I might put a few in though, so um, we'll see how that goes. Right, need more partitions. Oh, damn. Decorating your interiors in your house is so annoying now after playing with on um, Happy Home Paradise is so hard. Oh, well, Dana, I'm so glad that you can get here today. Um, I do try and do a mixture of streams, but obviously um, it's hard when it's so late. Maybe you can have some nice warm food in your main room. Yeah, let's do that. I keep accidentally clicking the recommend over videos and it's so annoying. Oh, Rowan. <laughs> I'm surprised I've seen it. I don't have the best eyes. Oh, mine are terrible. I'm definitely, I've arranged a appointment to speak to um, the opticians about getting contacts because I'm tired of having dirty glasses. I'm tired of them steaming up when I'm wearing a mask. I'm just, yeah, they just bother me. I like, I like, I like wearing glasses because I like the way that they look, but really glasses during COVID times are not fun. Oh no. Good luck, Rochelle. That sounds like it's gonna take a while. I need help. I make horrible villager houses, but Lottie saying I'm a legendary designer. A hundred? You've done a hundred? Wow. Wow. I know, I know I'm behind, but you've just made me feel even more behind. Okay, I'm gonna need more materials here. Oh, Rochelle, I don't believe that you ha you don't have any terraforming skills. Um, I've seen your interiors and I know you know how to play this game. <laughs> so I think you can do it for sure. I have faith in you. I was going to get contact, but I think there'll be a hassle take them in and out. Um... I, I don't mind touching my eyes. I'm just going to see how they go. It's like a free trial. That was what worried me initially. Um, why am I covering the doors? Because I don't want to decorate the other rooms. So I'm covering them so that I don't have to. Um, and I don't want to just leave them empty. I would rather just block them off. So I don't have to worry about it. Do you not find that they steam up? I find that I, I kind of, yeah, steam up. Well, interiors are different from terraforming. Mm, that's true. I make horrible homes though, and you actually decor deco them so I'm one more. Ah, uh, so I'm the one more behind. No. I hear about the glasses. I live in a cold climate, so glasses and mask and winter, winter hat is a lot around my ears. Yeah, definitely. Oh no, Danielle. That sounds like a catch 22. Can you get, what do you call it? Are they called like bifocals or very focals? Where they serve both long distance and short distance. Oh, hey, Caro. Oh no. I hope everything's all right. We do miss you. Oh. Oh, dearie me. These pillars, they're actually pretty finickety. Um, they're quite hard to get a hold of. Unless that's just user error. Probably user error. It's like when you open the door, yes. And then you're like, this is the worst time for my glasses to, to fog up because I'm literally taking something that's very hot out of the oven. Oh, Rowan. I imagine that that's a beautiful place to live though. It must be stunning. I'm always happy with my glasses, but I just want to have contact lenses, but I think they will cost 
Like they will cost like the world for me to get something. You can, I feel like you can get ones that are reasonably priced. Um, like monthly ones. So we'll have to see. Um, I know it's like a free trial thing. So I'll be interested. Oh, that's true. Oh, well, we know you're kind of studying and stuff, so that's totally fair enough. I guess it's like exam season coming up soon. Sad. A contact through the NHS? N no. I have to pay for my glasses as well, so um, it's not much difference, really. Unless, because my husband gets... Um, because of my husband's job, they pay for his glasses. Unfortunately, I don't get that perk. So either way, I have to pay for them. It's bachelor thesis season. Oh, yeah, that doesn't sound fun. Do I have any of the Moroccan tables? Because they are so cute. The white and the... I don't feel like you do. Let me come out of that. Can I ask an... Oh. Um, you can ask it, but um, I'm politely going to say that I don't talk about that. You can ask me literally anything else, but um, that's the one thing I don't kind of talk about. Um, just because it is like a little bit personal. Um, but yeah, pretty much anything else you can ask me about. I will tell you, it's not very exciting. <laughs> really not very exciting. Some people are big picture people. Oh, that's so true, Rochelle. I'm definitely not big people. Big people? Big picture. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, I'm definitely not big picture orientated. I can't do big builds. I definitely prefer smaller ones. For sure. Oh, the serving cart could be cute. Right, Emma, just decorate in one mode. Stop switching. Sorry, I just need to give myself a pep talk there. Oh, this could be cute behind. Okay, let's move this into the center of the room. Can I just say that <laughs> big people, I think. Oh dear. Um, Maybe like a little coffee station. Not big people person. I'm definitely, I'm probably not in real life. I'm a bit antisocial, so we'll go with that. Emma is a spy for Her Majesty's Secret Service. This channel is our undercover. Yeah, I'm just, this is like my undercover. I'm not really an Animal Crossing player. Um, yeah, we'll go with that. <laughs> um, I, I forgot my generic answer was I'm literally a barrel maker. I should have said that instead, but then that would be lying. So that's not really fair. Um, plants, let's find some plants in here. These are cute. But then do they fit properly? Does that look a bit off because of the window? Or do we think it works? Could it work? I can't do big ones either. When April did a huge castle, yeah. Definitely, Danny. It does blow my mind. <laughs> no. <laughs> No, that is not what I meant at all. I like all people, no matter shape or size. I just, yeah, I got my words mixed up, as I always do. And the wrong thing came out. Not that I had that on my mind. The only people I'm, I'm mean to are my villagers. How long have I been playing Animal Crossing? So I started playing Animal Crossing um, 2020, like May 2020. My husband showed it to me and he was like, oh, you'll really like this game. You'll really like this game. And I looked at it and I thought, oh, that looks a bit babyish. Um, I don't think I'll like it. And now I'm addicted. So yeah, if we get a divorce, it's because I'm addicted to Animal Crossing. So there we go. 
Uh, these could actually work. I like the blue in them. Hi, Berkeley. Welcome in. Oh, Rowan, I'm sorry. I hope you feel better soon. How's it going? We're good. How are you? On the upside, I've nearly finished... Nearly finished my island. And we're just working on my main room to stop people going and visiting the other empty rooms. Which sounds a bit mean when I say it. But yeah, I didn't mean to tell that. Uh, I forgot to tell you, I made a milk code. So I'm thinking I'm going to make a pigeon milk code too. <laughs> oh my gosh. Is that for the milk churn? Is it? Because if it is, I didn't realise they were customisable until the other day where you can put the logo on them. And that's amazing. Um, so we definitely need some pigeon milk churns up in here. Um, they, the shelves, they're just, they're a DIY. Yeah. And I'm going to put some milk in here. Because it's blue. And because Nietzsche said about milk. Oh, juggle bottles. Oh. And that works too. I recently got a paper saying one of my classes have COVID. Oh dear. I'm, I hopefully you'll be fine. You'll be surprised. This, I've had a, fl a few close encounters and I haven't caught it yet. So hopefully I'm sure you'll all be okay as well. My partner hates the game and he got it for me. <laughs> I am sure because of how much we love it, he's definitely... I was going to say to suggest a tea tea room for... Well, it's kind of is a tea room. I don't like the sandwich so much though. So maybe we should put a tea set or something here. We've just got the plain white one. That'll work. So they're pouring milk into their tea. I recommended the game to my friends. I had to explain it to them. It was hilarious. I think when you first um explain it to people they're probably a bit confused but it is it is super addictive um i feel like a fireplace would work but yeah that could work i've just realized this room is going to be impossible to take photos of i'm recently addicted to stardew and ignoring all the things i need to do Oh, have you been playing Stardew? I didn't realise, Nietzsche. I love Stardew Valley. I haven't played it in a long time. I keep thinking about playing it and then I don't. Um, but I will play it eventually. Um, maybe when I need a bit of a break from Animal Crossing. Um, how are you liking it? Do you love it? Have you? Are you playing on Switch or are you playing on computer because I feel like that makes a bit of a difference um I played sims 4 quite a bit um and also a stardew valley as we were just talking about um I did randomly play no I played quite a lot of fortnite as well just because I wanted to kill things um which sounds really sadistic but they're zombies so it's fine are they zombies yeah on the switch you love how fast paced it is oh okay hiya frog how are you i hope you're doing well i have no higher tables that are white why do this to me i'm over 50 and never played video games until animal crossing and now i'm obsessed i'm i'm not surprised you're obsessed it's a great game and it's so chilled i like the simple challenge where you each where each room you build has a different budget. That sounds like a great video idea. Hi Nora, how are you? Oh, you should check out Minecraft Dungeons. Adam and I play it with our friends and it's fun. Oh, I've played Minecraft before. But I've not played Dungeons. Honestly, people say that. And I'm really confused that it's... That people find it's... I, I mean, like, I get it. Like, it is confusing. 
maybe it is to begin with but when you get into it it is quite a simple yeah you're just farming it's like it's like an upgraded star um what do you call it like think of farmville but more intricate i'll go with that it's like farmville <laughs> It is, it is very cosy. It's super chill. Um, I'm trying to think of um, anything else you could even compare it to. Have you seen Over the Garden Wall? No, I haven't. Is that a film or is it a game? Oh, I like that you're able to play it with other friends. Dungeons is just like map achievements where you kill the bad guys. Oh, okay. Oh my god, Farmville, I haven't played that for years. It was the closest thing I could think of. It probably nothing alike, but... Is it wrong to have a decorative pillar next to a normal pillar? I actually quite like the way it looks. You can work with this. And I love this item. I'm not going to put it up there, though. It's a mini series, an amazing show. Oh, okay. It's so much harder doing this without being in Happy in Paradise where you have unlimited. Oh, I don't like that so much. That one's a bit better. But you have unlimited furniture. I don't know if it needs. Ooh, yes. Can you please use some jam jars because I love the look of them. If I have some. Hang on. Unfortunately, I don't think there's any blue jam jars. Do I have any jam? Mm. I have some peach ones. I'm honestly not sure where I'd put them though. They're there. They might not be there for much longer, I'm afraid, because I, I have no clue where to put them. Can I move these into the corner? Shadu and co-op is fun. Yeah, it is. I went through a phase of, we had a little farm on our Stardew fa um, Valley for a little while in co-op. That was really cute, actually. I don't know. The storyline is that there is a bad village that put a spell on others to protect it. Oh, that's cool. Honestly, I don't under I don't understand a lot of Minecraft, even though I did play it for a while, but it just confuses me a little bit. Shame I have all the ugly strap books. Oh, here we go. Can you design my in real life house? Trust me, my in real life house isn't as good as my Animal Crossing house. I would rather have <laughs> my Animal Crossing house any day. I would definitely try and remember that bamboo bamboozled her. This is going to be hard to decorate. If you're thinking about doing this, maybe don't because um, you actually have to be able to. Oh crap, I forgot about them. Um, you actually have to, um, what is up there? Um, you actually have to be kind of moving around the petition walls, which maybe in hindsight I should have added in last, but you know me, I like to make things difficult for myself, so that's what's going on. Uh, yeah, Story of Seasons, yeah, that's another good one. Whoops. I wish they had advised me on location of resident services as the location just doesn't work for me. I wish we could change the location of resident services as well. I think Captain Code Treasure Tracker. Oh, we have that, Rochelle. Um, I remember playing that for a little bit. It's fun. It's actually really fun. If you need something just like to chill and relax and do, that is definitely a great game to play. Hi, Ari Pink. How are you? 
Hope you're having a good weekend. Yeah, I'm thinking Animal Crossing and Stardew Valley as well. Good. Um, what can we put on the walls? Oh, you mean like that? Oh, okay. That makes sense, Sarah, actually. I think you can, like, yeah, you do go through things quickly, but you can just eat stuff. To get by. I know I used some rocket lights, didn't I? Two hours to find a map? Oh no, maybe I'm regretting saying that I will search for a new map on stream. Or I'll reset my island on stream. Because I don't fancy doing two hours of searching for an island. Oh, crap. Um, yeah, I didn't realise this time. I thought I said that I would do two hours. And I did say that I would do two hours. Okay, um, I might finish this room off stream then. Because I do have other things that I need to be doing. Um, let me just... We'll just put a desk area here. And then we shall be done with it. And then I will leave you all to enjoy the rest of your Sunday. Um, it's coming along, I think. We will get there. I don't really have any kind of blue chairs. I just play Sims 4 because I love to build and decorate houses. It is fun to just do that, isn't it? The stream where you started Maplewood was my first stream of yours? Or was it? Oh, well, Naya, I'm glad. Maybe we'll get some more amazing people like you aware of the channel if I do restart it on stream. Oh, we have a white computer. Let's do that. And there was something else next to it as well. Um, um, um. Oh, a camera. A camera would look cute on the desk. Okay, I think it needs a few more pieces here and there, definitely. Um, but yeah. Oh, Caro, I forgot to say you missed a new advert as well. Oh, no, you haven't, Minikyu. <laughs> We're still here. Um, I'm going to add some more items in. I'll probably do it off stream a bit later. Um, but yeah, that's okay. Thank you, Dale. Um, I will, if you're watching now and you missed the stream earlier, um, I'll play you the new ad now. This will be my third time playing it. Um, I just feel bad that Caro didn't get to see it. So <laughs> I'm going to play it just for her. So yeah, I'll play it for you. Um, have a great rest of your weekend. The schedule is up. I'm going to post it on the community page today so that you can see it as well. There is another stream this week. Um, so yeah. No, I'll play it for you now. It's fine. It's fine. We got this. Um, have a great day. And then the stream will end just after the advert. So yeah, wonderful stream. Thank you so much for all the fun chat. Thank you so much. Um, I'm going to stop talking. I always ramble at the end of the streams. So I will say goodbye now. Au revoir. Hello, totally awesome people. You can call me Hav if you want. Today I'm coming at you with an offer that will blow your mind. Are you wanting to escape the razzle dazzle of the city? And come and join us at my totally chill community co-op. The vibe is so mellow you'll spend your time horizontal. There are some super groovy residents to welcome you. If you have any questions bouncing around in your noggin, then get in touch. Peace out, man.